Hey, this is Mikey Borb with a quick After Effects tutorial, and this is just a quick kind of a technique on how to create drawing lines and arrows and scales and graphs, that kind of thing. This can really be applied to lots of different situations, so let me just kind of show you how I do these um, rather quickly. So first, I have a just a solid on here, and what I want to do is grab my pen tool and draw the line in which I want the graph to show. So this is for if you want like to show a graph that is is rising, the stocks are going up, you know, that kind of a thing. So I start and I just draw a line and then it maybe it nose dives. Right? I'm not going to close this off. I'm just going to leave it like that. Then what I need to do is go back to the layer go into the mask, go into the mask path, and then just hit Command C or copy. Close that off. Now I go to my paintbrush tools and then just double click and I'm just going to draw. It doesn't matter what I draw. And what that does is that creates the paint effect. And then I can come down here in the paint effect, go into the brush, and on the path, remember I had copied this mask path, and I'm just going to paste it right here. And that is now my line. And what I can do is go into the stroke options, and let's animate the end of this. So let's keyframe this, make that zero, go out two seconds, and make this 100. And you can see, just quickly, there's that. Now I want to add an arrowhead at the end of that. So let's get out of the paint mode, go back into here. And let's draw an arrowhead. So I'm just going to use a shape, to, a shape layer. Let's move forward so we, we, we can see. And let's draw an arrowhead. Let's make no stroke. Okay, I'm just doing this very quick. I could straighten this out a little bit, but I want to take this arrowhead. And first, let's use the pan behind tool. Keyboard shortcut is Y. And I'm going to drag and put the anchor point right there. Okay, now how do we animate this arrowhead with the line? Well, that's pretty simple. What I'm going to do is I already have the mask copied, the mask path copied, but just in case you uncopied it, let's copy it again. And then go into the shape layer, hit P to bring up my position, and then highlight the position, hit paste, and you can see that just follows along. Almost. We're almost there. It's not pointing in the right direction. So now let's go in, select the shape layer, go to layer, transform, auto orient. And what we can do is we can make this orient along the path. Click OK. Now when it did that, you can see it's no longer pointing in the right direction. But that's easy enough to fix just by rotation. Get that pointing in the right direction. And let's take a look at it now. Okay, pretty simple. Super quick, super easy way to create a a moving line graph. So, I hope this helps. I get a lot of questions about, you know, really simple stuff like this. So, if this helped you out and you thought it was great, I'd appreciate it if you share this video, make a comment. Um, if you have any questions, just feel free to ask. And thanks.